the People's Republic of China has quietly but systematically blocked out foreign tech products, citing cybersecurity concerns over the past decade. While the PRC is fighting similar efforts in the USA today, the full details of the PRC's plan to build its own secure and controllable system have never been reported outside of China until now. In the first years of his reign, Paramount leader Xi Jinping declared that there is no national security without cybersecurity and to build network power, we must have our own technology, mandating the PRC build a secure and controllable IT system while promoting domestically produced autonomous and controllable substitution plans. The PRC was once a major foreign tech buyer, with Sweden's Axis even boasting in 2010 of selling over 70 high-tech cameras for Tiananmen Square. People's Daily lamented that in 2014, most of the core software and hardware is imported, China's information security situation is serious, and that PRC networks can't get rid of the United States. The PRC's powerful cyber regulator warned that PRC tech was dominated by foreign products, causing a major security risk and, citing the Snowden scandal, declared domestication is a strategic requirement for national security. In 2015, under Xi, secure and controllable was cemented into the national security law. Government departments boasted of replacing all basic foreign hardware and software while touting that safety and controllability of domestic products is higher than imported products. The PRC government's procurement network touted purchasing domestic products to help cybersecurity, repeating Xi's maxim that there is no national security without cybersecurity. In 2017, PRC media noted foreign companies were absent from the PRC's largest security conference, stating many PRC projects include an express provision. The project does not accept bids for imported products. Today, PRC tech giants like Huawei and Hikvision often dismiss other countries' cyber concerns. But the PRC long ago determined that foreign products are a serious safety risk and systematically blocked them from its networks. This hypocrisy must be exposed.